Hey everybody, it's Dan from Cerberus LiveScan. I'm uh, gonna walk through uh, 153 a little bit as well as, uh, and predominantly the Fastbound integration that we've been working on the past couple months. Uh, we start off uh, going up to Configure Shop, and you'll see an integration tab now up here. I need to get your Fastbound account and your API key. You can get that from inside of Fastbound on Settings, your FFL, and then most importantly, the authorized email, uh, which should be the same email that you sign up with. Once you save and close, that will open up the API and open up some of the features inside of Cerberus. So I'm going to go into one of my test clients here and there's really four use cases that we have for Fastbound right now. So I can get the client from Fastbound. If I search by their last name, I can import the data that Fastbound stores inside of there. As we get done with a client, I can send that client to Fastbound so I can push the data that I've collected in Cerberus and insert them as a contact for future use inside of, uh, of Fastbound. And then lastly, or not lastly, next, uh, on the trust side to make the 5320.23 form, we can utilize uh, the Fastbound data to pull in and populate the form. So I'm gonna click on this. I got some dead air stuff in here, so I can search by um, anything that's associated with the firearm. I have manufacturer, model, serial number, caliber, etc. So say I wanted to look for all the dead air stuff that I have loaded in. Got some of those pieces loaded so I can see Sandman or uh, the masks. I'm going to filter this down to masks. And I'm going to grab this serial number, this 12345, and I'm going to close this form and send it down to Cerberus. So you see it populates down on the bottom here for there. The client would answer the questionnaire. We validate the data here and then we would create the RPQ. So it would make the PDF uh, for upload or if you're doing a form one also for upload or a paper form four, you can print everything out so that's that and then the other neat part about this I'm gonna grab a different client is that we can also mark this stuff for disposition so again I search by a customer last name I can pick the client and then I search by my items and I'm gonna grab that one two three four five and then just like that I can mark this item as disposed. It'll create a pending disposition inside of Fastbound, and then it will not show up on the Cerberus searches. And then depending on how your workflow works with everything else you have for Fastbound, uh, it will mark it as such. Again, that's the Fastbound integration in a nutshell. If you got any questions, please reach out to us. Uh, send us an email, uh, send me, uh, give me a call, shoot me a text, uh, and or hope to hear from you soon. Thank you.